over the moon to get it, get it over the line and get it sorted and I'm looking forward to get back into training and playing matches. What was it about Cambridge United that, that attracted you to, to even look in the first place? Um, well, I think it was like um, the meeting I had with, with the manager, um, the way he spoke and his positivity and his ideas for the club and where he wants to go was massive. Um, I've worked with Joe Dunn before and I, I loved working with him, um, his enthusiasm, his ideas for football. Um, it was a great opportunity to work with him again. So they really helped me in coming. Um, I wanted to sort of come home and be close to my family. Um, and when Cambridge, when I heard Cambridge was interested, I, I couldn't wait to speak to him and get it over the line and get going. After looking at the long list of clubs that you've previously played for, you vastly experienced right through the football league, and I guess at, even at the age of 34, you, you feel you've still got plenty to give. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got, I've got plenty of juice left. Um, you know. Um, I love playing football, I love learning, I love getting better each and each, each year. I'm not one of the guys who wants to just live on past things, I want to get better, I want to do more than I did last year. Um, and I think it's a great place for me in my career to come and, and do that and um, try and get success and bring some good, some goals and some hopefully some playoffs and some promotion this year. I know you've obviously already spoken just to head coach Sean Derry and the conversation was along the lines of he played to, to a similar age in his mm -hmm. career and that's something you can learn from him. Yeah, definitely, it was, it was a massive factor. Um, as well, because he can he can advise me on how and um, things he did because he played very well um, to a later age as well. Um, and in terms of like what he's, his ideas and training regimes and what he wants for the team and how I can sort of help people to come on and be successful and, and lead by example, which is something I was I jumped at the opportunity to do. Obviously, touched upon your, your previous relationship with Joe Dunn at Colchester. Any of the other lads within the squad that you've known from previous clubs or you've come across before? Yeah, I mean, um, Leon, Leon Legg, I've always often played against him and respected him and often not really look forward to playing against him, so it'd be nice to suddenly play with him for once. Um, I've played with David Amu and um, Luke Berry, so I look forward to sort of linking up with them and, and, and getting amongst the dressing room and meeting all the other boys as well. More recently, spent two seasons at Carlisle United in the promotion push there, and I guess that will be aims, similar aims here. Yeah, fantastic. I mean, I've still got the buzz of sort of being being amongst that and a great dressing room, and you know, you, you learn what it kind of takes to sort of be in and amongst that, those positions. And you know, I feel I feel good, and I feel the good energy to bring here, and hopefully we can we can do it as well. I know a few Cambridge United fans are all unfortunate remember the goals you've scored against Cambridge United, but how much are you looking forward to running out here at the Cam's Glass Stadium for the first time in front of them? Yeah, yeah, I look forward to it. Um, and, you know, and stick some goals in for, for you guys this time. Um, but no, I, I just can't wait to get going. You know, I want to get back in, back in the training, get back playing and um, have another good season. Brilliant. Welcome to the club. Brilliant. Thanks very much.